Hi guys, this is Abby Eagle and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a triangle in Photoshop. So what we do is we start, go get the shape tool over here, I'm going to click on the uh, rectangular tool, then when you've got the shape tool you get a uh, little menu box up here, just make sure that you've got this got shape get your cursor, it's got a little square there, and as you drag it around you get different shapes but what you do is you hold the, no matter where you are, if you hold the shift key it'll actually come into a perfect square. Then you let go the mouse key and there you are. So as you can see it's already got a stroke but I'll show you how we do that. If you come up the top here to the menu bar and if we click on say the fill and we get a blue just give it a blue fill okay and then we come across to the stroke we can take this not the stroke out or keep it in there let's keep it and then you're able to adjust the width so let's just give it say five points looks okay come back to the move tool and position it down there and then to make a square, uh, to make the square into a triangle, come up here, get your pen tool, go to the little menu, you'll get a delete anchor point tool, come over here, click on the square, then you'll get a little, um, little node on each of the corners, you get a little node, then you click on, well you put the mouse over this node and you get a little minus sign, okay, then click it, there you go, you've got your triangle, come back up here to the move tool, uh, show transform tools, and then we just turn it over. So it's about square, come back up here, it's 134.28, but I want it to be 135, like to be precise, click on the move tool, apply the transformation, get rid of the ugly um, transform controls, and there we have a triangle. But let's say you want to make a triangle with rounded corners. Then what you do is you go back to your shape tool, take the rounded rectangular tool, get your little square, and hold down the shift key. There we go. Take the move tool. All right, let's position it over there. But this time, why don't we, so you go back over here, if you want to modify, you have to go and get your um, shape tool once again. So we go up here, we get the menu, let's just change the fill, say to brown, and let's leave the stroke at five point. Then we come back up here to the pen tool, delete anchor point tool, we click once, then we click again, now, I don't know if you can see it, but what you have, you have two little um, open squares, all right? So they're unselected um, anchor points. And I'm going to go over here. There's a little minus sign. Whoa. Okay, there we go. So now what we have is this. You get this, I think it's an adjustment handle, all right? Adjustment handle, Bezier tool. And... The black dot is the adjustment point. Then you've got your curve, all right, which you can play with, but that's like for another tutorial. But let's just put it there for a bit of fun. And then when you come back up here, you put your tool over the little node. Click, there it goes, beautiful. And we get the move tool, show transform controls, put it there, you get your little um, semicircle thing. Let's just put it over here. So there we go. Get it about right. Let's just make that precisely 135 degrees. Um, apply the transformation. There we are there. Just knock it down a little bit. There we go. So now you have um, two triangles, one with sharp corners, one with rounded corners. That's how to make a uh, triangle in Photoshop. 
CS6 are much the same as CC2, I understand. So if you found this video to be of value, please like it and subscribe and let me know what videos you want me to make for you. And remember to challenge everything for the truth. And I'll see you next time.